Welcome student. Today we are going to solve this problem. If x equal to r cos theta, y is equal to r sin theta. Then show that partial r upon partial x is equal to cos of theta and partial theta upon partial x equal to minus sin theta upon r. So, given x is equal to r cos theta, y is equal to r sin theta. x square plus y square is equal to r square cos square theta plus r square sin square theta. This is equal to r square cos square theta plus sin square theta. And cos square theta plus sin square theta is equal to 1. So this is equal to r square into 1 equal to r square. Which implies x square plus y square is equal to r square. Now we have to find first partial r upon partial x is equal to cos of theta. So differentiating with respect to partial differentiating with respect to x. Partial upon partial x of x square plus y square is equal to partial upon partial x of r square. Remember r is not constant here. r is a function of x and y which implies partial upon partial x of x square plus partial upon partial x of y square is equal to partial upon partial x of r square. Partial derivative of x square is equal to 2x and partial derivative of y with respect to x is 0. And on the right hand side, we have 2r and the partial r upon partial x, which implies 2r partial r upon partial x is equal to 2x. And which implies 2 is cancel out here. Partial r upon partial x is equal to x upon r, which implies partial r upon partial x is equal to, as x is equal to r cos of theta, so r cos theta upon r, r is cancelled out here, so we get partial r upon partial x is equal to cos of theta. So our first result is two. Next we prove that partial theta upon partial x is equal to minus sine theta upon r. Again x is equal to r cos theta y is equal to r sin theta which implies y upon x is equal to r sin theta upon r cos theta r is cancelled out here which implies y upon x is equal to tan theta tan theta now we partially differentiate this with respect to theta implies uh, with respect to x partial upon partial x of y upon x is equal to partial upon partial x of tan theta so we are partially differentiating with respect to x so y is constant y into partial upon partial x of 1 upon x is equal to partial 
derivative of tan theta. This implies y partial derivative of 1 upon x is minus 1 upon x squared. Derivative of tan theta is secant square theta, secant square theta and partial theta upon partial x. Which implies secant square theta partial theta upon partial x is equal to minus y upon x square. Putting the value of x and y, secant square theta, partial theta upon partial x is equal to minus y is equal to r sin theta upon x is equal to r cos square theta, r square cos square theta. Next step, we shift this term in on right hand side, partial theta upon partial x is equal to minus r sin theta upon r square cos square theta and to 1 upon secant square theta. which implies partial theta upon partial x is equal to first we cancel out r here minus sin theta upon r cos square theta and 1 upon secant square theta is equal to cos square theta cos square theta is cancelled out here we obtain partial theta upon partial x is equal to minus sine theta upon r. This is our required result. Thank you for watching this video.